Purvis in second place. Just in front there, you can see Glatzer just keeping an eye on Purvis, having to lean right round, craning his neck to look into the eyes of uh, Francois Purvis. How does he even know where the bike's got to go? Well, here we are. They're trying to outdo each other, outfox each other as Glatzer goes to the front and Purvis is now right in on the wheel here. He's starting to wind it up tracking each other all over the place as Glatzer dives down to the bottom of the track, hits the gauge line, having to work the bike really, really hard. He's fighting the gear. Purvis looks a lot faster. They almost touch elbows, but it's Purvis who goes 1-0 uh, up against uh, Glatzer. And he actually made that look relatively simple. A little punch. He's happy with the finish there. As you can see, Glatzer is a lot more of a punchy rider. It's like he's fighting the bike, that right elbow going all over the place and really tying up before the finish. Purvis 1-0 up for France and uh, of course the riders will go through to a second run to decide uh, who goes through. If required, it will go to three rides.